We've got the French invaders coming in the flyweight division. And Aaron Cambor is going to throw them back into the sea, or at least that is his intent this evening. It's all to play for. Aaron Colburn, always so composed, absolutely just a professional, as is indi indicated by his rise up the pro ranks. He's already got a win. He's looking to put two together. But he's got Lee Mariakra. Mariakra? Standing aside from him. We're into our final three fights of the evening, folks. Thank you very much for joining us on Battle Arena's stream. We bring you all the best MMA from all of Europe in the professional and amateur ranks. So you may have joined us just now, maybe tuning in to some of the best professional fights that Europe has to offer, or you might have been following us all evening, in which case, thank you very much. And I'm glad that you enjoyed some of our amateur bouts as well. But making his way into the cage, unfortunately, I haven't overheard his name, so it's gonna be very hard for me to say Meriakre. I don't even know, unfortunately. I wish I could say it, but I can't. Lee Miracle. Can we just say Lee? We're yeah. going with Lee. Yeah. We'll go with Lee for now. <laughs> I'll wait for Karsten to say it again. <laughs> Karsten is, uh, is actually fluent in French, so he has the accent of is any really? French name spot on. Yes. Wow. I'm lying. <laughs> he looks like he one of those people that would speak French randomly. He's just such a cool person. Now, Aaron Coborn just ran through Duncan Jalali, ran through Max Maldente, and now he's moved into those pro ranks. And he's looking as shredding and scary as ever. And he's got this power. Is sponsored by Introducing first the fighter in the red corner. Weighing 58.8 kilograms. 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 That's one win as a pro. It's not counting all the amateur fights where he went undefeated with multiple titles. We got Ila Miraclu, Aaron Camborn. Ila. Ilya in the Ilya. Venom shorts. We'll go with Ilya for now. Ilya Coborn in the grey. Merakru. I like Merakru. We'll go with Merakru in the Venom, Coborn in the grey. Coborn was so composed in his last fight. Yeah. And we'll, I want to see a little bit. Yep. You see a bit of this now. Yeah. Floating okay. lead hand. He Step. has power, Steve. That's and the thing about Coborn. He's he got incredible range, understanding of range. But right? he does hang his chin out. And with that's to lead in for the counter. Mera Cruz, very light on his feet, trying to pick those shots. This is the difference between the amateurs and the pros. Look, they're just, just feeding each other out, not rushing in. And you'll see with some of the earlier amateur fights, there was a rush. Coburn caught the kick, 
Made Mera Krupe try to come home with the right. Oh, Ooh, once again. Calf kick. Kobold's got to be careful. He's reaching down low trying to catch kicks. Mera Krupe fake it, come high. That's the thing, the best amateurs become pros. So even though you were just the best, you might have been the best amateur, you're going to be running into mirror versions of yourself in the pro yep. ranks. Got to be ready for it. Pumps it out, runs forward as Coburn. Oh, power from both wow. guys, hitting remember, the pocket, this dirty is boxing. The, this is professional, so there's elbows allowed, knees to the head allowed. Yeah. It adds a new dimension to these fighters. Coburn has one amateur fight, or sorry, one professional fight to his name. A rather quick victory, actually. This is not the... F oh, oh, big right hand, oh. and he's barked him. He's put him down. Alan Jackson still stopped stop the That contest. was a huge finish. Maracu landed some big shots. Coburn's very upset about the stoppage. I mean, how much was he counter wrestling out of instinct? How much was he actually still in the fight? I think well, he dropped be, him down, and a, then there was... Yeah. I want to see that replay of the replay of the finish of this fight. To Can know, you, is there any way? To, this is. It'd be nice to look at it. Obviously, then you get some controversy because of the way he got back up. But I reckon it was because Alan Jackson intervened. Ilya backed off, and yeah, that allowed Coburn to pop up. That's the thing. Otherwise, but I want to see. Can I see We'll try and get a replay for you guys at home. I mean, based on, it's it's so hard at full speed. So in my opinion, it was a it was a reasonable stoppage. I'm not saying it was a good stoppage. It's but hard it at these pro stoppage. levels, isn't it? Because he yeah. did he did knock him. He was I he mean was out he and then he hit the ground. Three big shots. And obviously, Alan Jackson's job is fight a safety over everything. Coburn's team is not going to be happy about this, though. <laughs> Mary Crew. Stunning uh, MMA pro debut for the uh, Maria Kuru. Aria Coburn's going to be very frustrated with that. Let's see if we can get a replay from the truck here. Maybe a Maria Kuru, fantastic performance. Maria Cruz showing how it's done. What a pro debut. I mean, putting away, stopping the amateur and undefeated pro, Aaron Coborn. Fantastic performance. I know Aaron Coborn great and his team are a little bit frustrated with the stoppage. You can never really know until you see the replay. You've got to watch it in slow-mo, see what damage was done. I think you can really see the result. 